yes please. Good morning dudes. I don't even know how to start off this vlog right now. Except to say, it's gonna be an awesome day. It's gonna be just like yesterday, the day before. We're getting into a lot of stuff. We're gonna be hanging out, skateboarding, and just doing New York. It's, it's, been, uh, it's been incredibly cool. I like it a lot. And this morning I gotta run errands, so that is what you are about to see. Come on. If you have your extra care card, please scan it now. To start, simply begin scanning your items and follow the system prompts. And if you're thinking, John, you just got shampoo, conditioner, body wash, and toothpaste? Haven't you been there for two days? Yeah, uh, I'm a pretty disgusting dude. I just stopped by the apartment and this is what it's like to feel a little bit clean. I'm meeting up with Sarah right now actually because we're grabbing lunch and then we both have to do like a lot of behind the computer stuff. So she's going her way, doing her thing. You're gonna see. I'm updating a lot of my skateboard. I, yeah. This is my version of a transition. From there I met up with Sarah. Then we went to Central Park. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Time since I've updated. We, did you see here that update? I was listening to that lady and I was like, it has been. Um, it's been a long time since I updated. We just walked around Central Park, yeah. am I right? For the longest time. It was so, so pretty. And it's already about to get dark. I had I thought it was 12.30 and it's what? It's, let's see. Like three-ish, right? 3.07. How to, we about to who to? Yeah, Hopefully. so so I for myself, even though we gave away some of my channel, I myself am hopefully gonna get myself some of these guys right here. Oh, it's closed. Wonky hours. What is today? Say a weekend day? Yeah. Oh, wait. It's not open on New Year's. Oh, is it still recording? You. You'd fall in love with anyone. I think you'd fall in love with Juice press. Moment All of right. truth. We'll see how good. This is a very green one. <laughs> it's good. It's delicious. It's actually kind of spicy though. Yeah. Am I wrong? Totally wrong. Is there a little after? Uh, I was gonna surprise you. This is actually a car that I just bought. Oh uh, my I gosh. It here to take us home. But you're like so fancy that you just left it in the middle of the road. Exactly. If you what own one, you can park there. What do you mean? What is that? It's your car. <laughs> it's just a Ferrari X4. I have no idea what any anything is. You want to take a picture? Oh, of course. Right. 100%. Awesome. Yo. Oh, nice. Can I your video? Nice yeah, you're here right now. Oh, that's sick. I heard what? Awesome. awesome. What was your name? Tyler. Tyler, dude. Awesome meeting you. Yeah, yeah, man. Are you going to be in the video? So What's up? Am I going to be in the video? Yeah. Do you want to be? Yeah. What's your name again, Tyler? Yeah. Dude. Awesome meeting you. <laughs> yeah, okay, these are, fresh. yeah. Yeah, I just got camo pants and that is, yeah, you're so sick right now. This is Sarah Dietschy's creepy place. Okay, brief conversation about what is going on right now. Sarah is actually collaborating with someone in her apartment, she's filming this segment, and while she's doing that, I'm actually gonna get my skateboarding in. It's been a long day, fellas. It has been a long, a lot of walking, the most ridiculous amount, but now I'm gonna try to cruise and actually get some clips. Dude, what's up? Basically, I'm really stoked you guys are watching right now. I'm really glad that I get to do this. And uh, I just farted.
cannot believe what just happened. First of all, this is crucial. Which is where my story starts off. I came up here to film the outro for my video. As soon as I got up here, I noticed that I didn't have my card for my camera, and that's when it all began. Now, if the door is all the way closed, this is what happens when you try to open it. Absolutely nothing. No matter how hard you pull, no matter how hard you try. Just try to imagine my panic from there and what my next step was. I looked around and I was like, okay, I'm five stories high. I have no idea where to go. So I climbed this part right here, and then of course, I hop on down and glance over here, and I think this part of the roof is actually attached to someone's room, so I'm gonna be very delicate right now. So I walk over to the edge right here to see if there's any way for me to escape, but no, there is not. The closest fire escape is about a 12 foot jump right here and there's no way I would survive that because I would fall. So just for the benefit of the doubt, I climbed these stairs right here and of course this extra bird's eye view is of no help. So of course I scaled this area a little bit. I look around the building, I try to find something, anything. I even see this room right here and think that it's some way to save my life. 100% locked. And of course I went straight to this. From there, I was in sheer panic, because I'm not gonna sit here and just scream my name and be like, hell, I'm on this roof stuck, because nobody else can get in this building except for the tenants that live here, and this is an Airbnb. I'm not trying to make a huge scene and get in a lot of trouble, so I looked around and I'm like, dude, I have to get off this roof, even if I have to jump. I'm not gonna jump. And the last option I could think of, this roof over here. Roof hopping, Ninja 101. Best option, go from here to here. And then I made it past level one. I walked right over here and I looked at this little hop. This little, small, skinny hop and realized the in-between is this. And I know it seems like it's really, really easy, but I just heard a story about a girl dying in an alleyway just like this. So, I went to the other side and I saw this. The door slightly ajar. I walked down the stairs, slowly but surely, and they were doing construction. They were painting the stairs. I ran into a guy. It was extremely, extremely awkward. That's why I'm not doing a round two with that. And I went all the way down, and then I saw the entrance, the oh, so glorious entrance. And there I was, free, free from captivity. Also, the building where I actually got out of, there's a guy standing right in the front. It's like a construction zone right now. Before I ended this vlog, I wanted to rehash on an old quote that I used by Albert Einstein, submitted to me by Dagny McIntosh. says, if you wanna live a happy life, tie it to a goal, not to people or things. It's hard to avoid feeling like I'm on a vacation when I just sit here and I'm like, oh my gosh, New York City, I walk around, it's beautiful, hanging out with awesome people, and I just get really distracted by that idea, but I have so many goals this year. There's so many things that are gonna connect me to a deeper, more meaningful life in my opinion and being more in a position to actually do things that make other people happy which you know for me makes me very very happy so focus on the goals if you want the true happiness I 100% believe that and as for you dudes watching this video right now thank you so much for showing support for viewing for subscribing for liking all the things that you guys do to try to grow this channel and for all the people who have just been here throughout who are just currently watching in and for the people to come in the future you won't be hearing this message but Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you tomorrow for another video. Love you guys. Progress daily. Keep killing us. For me, Happy New Year's to everyone. I don't know if I've officially said that in the last two videos, but seriously, welcome. 2017, we're here. We're at...